A Bolivian Aymara indigenous painter Roberto Mamani is displaying his erotic symbolism in bold colors at an exhibition in La Paz, Bolivia. It's the first time for this famous indigenous artist to have his work displayed in the National Art Museum of Bolivia. Mamani say the paintings hide sexuality behind symbol, much the way the Andean culture keeps its sexuality largely private. Amongst toads, bulls, testicles, and other nudes is the cryptic name of a new exhibit by Bolivian painter Roberto Mamani Mamani. The exhibit opened on March 27 at La Paz's National Art Museum. And like the name of the exhibit, the paintings take a cautiously symbolic approach to eroticism and sexuality, both taboo subjects in indigenous cultures. Mamani, an Aymara Indian, said the paintings hide sexuality behind symbols much the way the Andean culture keeps its sexuality largely private. This entire series has erotic content. Eroticism is not shown much in the Andean region. It's more private, religious. In these paintings, the spectator uncovers elements and symbols of female organs, male organs, phallic symbols, all of them related to fertility and procreation, which eroticism related to the Andean region. According to Aymara symbols, toads represent fertility, while bulls represent manliness. Mamani is among Bolivia's most noted contemporary painters, with awards under his belt, as well as numerous international shows. But this is the first time his work has been displayed at the National Art Museum in La Paz. Many chalk his absence at the museum up to discrimination against Bolivia's indigenous. I had won a national prize. I had had exhibits in many museums across the world. For numerous reasons, my work was exhibited at the National Art Museum. Someone should ask the people who run the museum, people who perhaps understand art, if they think what I do is art. Poverty forced Mamani to start painting on newspaper. After nearly 20 years in the business, not much else has changed. He did the almost 200 paintings for the exhibit at the museum in just four months, working out his humble home and painting to rhythm of Andean music. Extremely popular on the Indian plateau, Mamani hopes to break the record for visits to a museum. TITV Weekly.